in room two. If I probably got off house of this, it probably would have took all the way to this time of life for me to go on stage. Mm. That's deep. I think that's my cheat code, staying off the stage. In the world of hip hop, few names have ignited as much passion and debate as NBA young boy. Born Kendrell Deshaun Golden, he exploded onto the music scene like a supernova. His raw, unfiltered lyrics resonating with a generation that felt misunderstood and marginalized. However, his authenticity came at a price. Youngboy's lyrics were steeped in violence, pain, and a lifestyle that many criticized but couldn't look away from. He was a paradox, a young rapper with the world at his feet yet seemingly unable to escape the gravitational pull of his past. In this video, we'll tell you how NBA Youngboy might not be able to bail out this time, as the FBI now wants him forever behind bars. Before we get started, make sure to leave a like and comment on this video. And if you'd like to join this month's giveaway of a brand new iPhone 12, then all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and watch this video until the end to find and comment the hidden message. Good luck. A troubled history. As NBA Youngboy star rose, so did his notoriety. His criminal history is as extensive as his discography, painting a picture of a young man caught in a relentless cycle of crime and punishment. The trouble began in the ninth grade. Youngboy dropped out of high school and began engaging in criminal activities. His early foray into crime saw him arrested and sent to a detention center. Yet, even after his release, he remained undeterred, refusing to change his ways. His determination to pursue music led him to steal money to buy the necessary equipment, marking the beginning of his musical journey. At the tender age of 17, Youngboy was arrested for his involvement in a drive-by shooting. It was a harbinger of things to come, a signal that, despite his burgeoning career, the streets still had a hold on him. Over the years, his rap sheet grew longer, including charges for assault, weapons possession, and drug offenses. In 2016, just before a concert in Texas, NBA Youngboy was arrested for opening fire on a crowd in South Baton Rouge, Louisiana. The police held him on a $200,000 bond. Youngboy claimed that his arrest was due to his fame, but despite his denials, it was evident that he was associating with the wrong crowd. Many speculated that in an attempt to bolster his bad boy image, he acted recklessly. In 2017, he accepted a plea deal on one count of assault with a firearm. In 2018, NBA Youngboy was arrested on charges of kidnapping, weapons violations, and assault right before he was about to take the stage. TMZ reported that he had assaulted his then-girlfriend Janiah Jackson, with the altercation captured on CCTV. The footage showed Youngboy pushing someone to the ground leading to his arrest. Although Janiah later tweeted it wasn't her in the video, police remained convinced that Youngboy had assaulted someone regardless of their identity. In 2020, Youngboy's involvement in a significant drug and weapons bust in Louisiana further marred his record. Among 16 major arrests, he was implicated in drug distribution charges. Despite his lawyers' claims that he abstained from drugs, the court found it difficult to believe that he was uninvolved, given his history. A career of potential. Despite his numerous run-ins with the law, NBA Youngboy's career was nothing short of meteoric. His relentless work ethic and raw talent propelled him to the upper echelons of the rap industry. His discography is a testament to his prolific nature, with albums and mixtapes dropping at a rate that few could match. His debut studio album, Until Death Call My Name, released in 2018, was a commercial success, peaking at number 7 on the Billboard 200. The singles Outside Today and Diamond Teeth Samurai became instant hits, cementing his place in the rap world. His follow-up projects, including AI Youngboy 2 and Top, debuted at number 1, proving his consistent ability to captivate audiences. Youngboy's collaborations further showed his versatility and appeal. He worked with some of the biggest names in the industry, including Juice World, Lil Baby, Da Baby. Each collaboration was a masterclass in synergy, blending his gritty style with the unique flavors of his collaborators. What set NBA Youngboy apart was his ability to stay relevant despite his legal troubles. 
even during his stints in jail, he released music, often recorded in makeshift studios over the phone. His 2020 project, Still Flexin', Still Steppin', dropped while he was incarcerated. Yet it climbed the charts with ease, proving his music's enduring appeal. The downfall? The Utah arrest. Despite his musical success, NBA Youngboy's life continued to be marred by legal issues. The latest and most severe chapter in his saga unfolded in April of this year, in which he was arrested in Utah for allegedly orchestrating a large-scale prescription drug fraud ring. Authorities claim that Galden was at the center of a scheme involving fraudulent prescriptions for promethazine and codeine, which were called into multiple pharmacies across the state. The operation reportedly involved several accomplices and the use of fake identities, forming what officials describe as an ongoing criminal enterprise. Galden was taken into custody and booked into Cache County Jail, just north of where he'd been serving house arrest in Weber County. The arrest report detailed sophisticated schemes in which fake prescriptions were created by impersonating a physician and using a valid DEA number to obtain controlled substances. The investigation revealed that the fraudulent activities had been ongoing for several months, with multiple incidents documented in a lengthy report. During the execution of a search warrant at Golden's residence, authorities found a firearm and various prescription medications further implicating him in the operation. Golden denied any knowledge of the fraudulent activities during a police interview, but evidence presented by investigators painted a different picture. His arrest in connection with the drug fraud ring added another layer to his already complex legal situation and impacted his ongoing legal battles and public image. The tragic prediction. As we stand on the precipice of what seems to be the end of NBA Youngboy's career, it's hard not to reflect on what might have been. Here was an artist with extraordinary talent, a young man who has the potential to change the world with his music, yet his inability to break free from his past, his choices, and his environment led him down a path of destruction. And as the legal system gears up for what may be the final chapter in this saga, fans and critics are left to ponder the legacy of NBA Youngboy. Will he be remembered as a musical genius who couldn't escape his past, or as a cautionary tale of squandered potential? And with this, we've come to the very end of this video. Let us know in the comments what you think of NBA Youngboy, and will his career ever change in the future? Let us know your thoughts on the whole video down below, and don't forget to leave a like on this video. And if you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button to catch all of our future content. Thanks for watching, until next time!